Hello my friends, today I will show you how to fix your HTTP website and convert it to HTTPS and I will show you how to fix mixed content on your WordPress so both of this tutorial let's go directly to the point so as you see my website is not secure okay first of all we need to secure the website to make it HTTPS and after that I will show you how to disable mixed content so first of all go to your cPanel you have to install the certificate and you be sure your website and your domain name has a certificate installed pre-installed before so let's go to uh, SSL certificate here okay here it is SSL status certificate and uh, click all these domain names here and run auto SSL okay you have to wait maybe one two three or five minutes for this auto generation SSL so I'm waiting for this right now to be generated we have the certificate installed on our server okay now next step is go to your dashboard your website dashboard okay click go to your WordPress dashboard so you have to log in so here we are next step is you have to go to settings go to general and here replace the HTTP to HTTPS okay put both and click save so we did the save changes so you will be logged out and now you will it will ask you to log in again put again the the credentials okay here we are okay so let's see we did replacing HTTP okay we did this step 2 we have to add this on HTTPS access okay okay go back on your cPanel nice go to file manager find your website here HTTP access if you are not able to see HTTP access you go to settings here at the top and uh, you click this button show the hidden files and click save and you will be able to see okay click edit click edit again and you will put put here at the top this code and click save now go back to your website again okay the website is shows for me the secure next you have to install the plugin for uh, changing you know mixing content but let's go back here go and install the plugin the plugin is search and replace is this one here the yeah install it on your WordPress activate it okay go to tools search and replace and first of all back up your database okay we have to create a SQL file and we have to download it because we need to have a backup of our website or we have to have a backup for this database download your SQL file after you download it go to search and replace okay so search and replace copy your domain name put it here search for HTTP and replace with HTTPS okay guys select all remove this dry run save changes to the database okay do search and replace let's see now 
It's sensitive, it's very important to back up your database first. Okay, so we did. Let's go back now to here and refresh the page. We are done with the plugin and we see the website is secure right now. But what if, if you still have some problem with your website? If I click now, listen live, you will see here my content is not secure. So, so what I have to do? So this is custom code. This mini page, uh, it's done with um, custom code. So what we have to do is we have to find and replace the links who are um, coded on this on this script. So first of all, I just hit the F12, go to console, and you will see some uh, HTTP content linked on this on this uh, small window. Okay, so now we have mixed content, and so now we replaced we replaced everything on the database, but we have some extra code on PHP for only for this on air page. So what do you have to do? We have to edit one by one. Okay, so let's go and fix the content now. So this is what you have to do manually. What I, what I have to do, I will go to theme editor because we did some extra, um, extra custom code. Okay, find here in my case, yes, I have radio player here I just click on the radio player and look at this I have some content who is with HTTP so what I have to do I have to put an S in every the every link okay I'm doing this manually all this content is on my um, WordPress folders because it's not on the database it's on the WordPress folder so I'm replacing every every little links here manually right now in my case but in your case you have to see what you what you did or custom code or something if you didn't do any custom code or any custom page like I did you don't have to do what I'm doing and your website it will work automatically so so I think I'm done okay I will update the file and now open up again I just click refresh I have to yeah to close that the page is secure this is how we full fix the website if you have any other questions just type me a comment below thank you guys for watching and god bless you